Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Noon. Katatanggap ko lang kanina guys. At samahan nyo ko i-unbox natin to. Titignan natin kung ano ang laman. Okay? Acer C Acer A315 Dust 56 Aspire 3 model So Check natin Buksan na natin agad Ay, ito pala yung specs niya sa kabila. Ito guys, pag makita nyo, is siya ay Core i3. Core i3 processor. 4GB RAM. At 1TB hard disk. Okay, wow. So, very new guys. Tech note guys, hindi sa akin to ha. Uh, pinadala lang sa akin dito, diretso. Kasi, um, gusto niya, loadan ko ng mga apps. At saka Windows 10. Take note pala guys, yung kanyang nabiling uh, laptop ay non-OS. So, wala siyang Windows na kasama. Ayan. So, kaya pinadala niya dito sa akin para ako nang bahalang mag-load ng operating system at mga program applications. Pero advisable pa rin guys, kung bibili kayo ng laptop, kung kaya naman ng budget, kuha na kayo ng may original or may kasamang uh, original na Windows operating system. Mas advisable yun. Okay? Okay, so open na natin yung kanyang box. Wow. So, ito yung laptop. Mamaya na natin buksan. Check mo na natin yung content. Yung kanyang box. So, meron siyang uh, user manual. Ayan. Master Manual Guide English At meron din siyang kanyang Warranty Card Meron siyang uh, Terms and Warranty Siguro sa online yun na siya I-registered for warranty Okay, yan magkasama yung tatlong papel na yan And International uh, User Manual So ayan yung mga language support Dito sa loob Okay, yan yung sama At yung kanyang small box which is anong kasama nito power cable okay so meron siyang power cable and yung kanyang charger yes anliit lang ng kanyang charger guys yung kanyang extra power cable Yan. European type yung kanya isa naman ay round type yan ito yung mga pang Asia ok wow so 15 inch tadang Acer so it's a black color brand new guys natin wow ang linis see guys core i3 alam ko pag gantong color ng sticker ay 10th generation na siya so bago yung kanyang processor so 15 inch guys merong uh, HDMI na okay very good tapos may USB 3 
version 3 at uh, may USB 2 and uh, meron din siyang kanyang uh, Ethernet cable pang LAN okay. at sa kabila naman ay may isang extra na uh, USB 2 port okay so dito yung kanyang power yung kanyang speaker ay dito ito na yung kanyang speaker guys yan kabila ang dalawa speaker at uh, meron din siyang uh, built in na webcam so ito yung model na Aspire 3 yan so magaan lang siya guys very handy Pwede po dito sa mga pang online class. Wow. Pero yung kanyang battery built in sa loob. At ito rin yung mga sinasabi kong walang quick access. So kapag kailangan mo nang mag-upgrade ay talagang bubuksan mo yung buong back panel para makapag-upgrade ka. Okay? So installan ko muna ng Windows 2 guys tapos Papakita ko sa inyo after ng kanyang performance kung gaano siya kabilis. Okay? Bago pa lang lahat guys, shout out kay Sir Jason. Sir, ito na yung uh, unit mo. Uh, maraming salamat sa iyo sir. At uh, share ko lang sa iyo ang video na to para mapanood mo kung paano ginawa ang iyong laptop. Thank you very much sir. Okay guys, and this time I want to show you again how to install the Windows 10 operating system to this Acer laptop. Okay, so we have to use also our um, boot up disk. I already created on this USB plus. First, insert the USB to one of the USB port. Okay, and then open the laptop. Power on. And then press F2. Okay, now we are on BIOS setup. This one, guys, the secure boot, we need to disable this one. I'll try to put supervisor password. Put one, one, okay, confirm one, and then uh, continue, enter. And now check the boot. So now we can access the secure boot. See, can change now. We have to disable this one enter and then disable now it's disabled already the priority boot up order it's no problem we can select number two okay then press f10 to save then yes then press f12 after boot up so now we are on uh, boot manager you have to select number two the usb okay press enter Okay guys, Windows uh, 10 Pro now is uh, loading. See, we are now on uh, Windows menu. And the language is uh, English United States. So you can press next and then install now. Then accept the license terms. Next. And then choose this one. Custom. Install Windows in advance. Uh, we are now on partitioning. This laptop comes with a 1TB hard disk. We can uh, divide into two, uh, make it uh, drive C and drive D to partition. We have to check this new capacity. We have to divide it by two. So let's see, 1TB is 1000. So this is a 949. We can set the drive C as uh, 500 GB. Okay, so this 5000 megabyte. Okay, apply. Okay. The unallocated space is uh, 438. This drive 0, we have to assign this as drive D. So click this one, and then we have to apply all the remaining capacity. Apply. Okay. Now you have uh, 3 and 4 partition. This uh, 1 and 2 are all uh, reserved partition. And then the number 3, this is your drive C. Okay. And then number 4. This is your drive the partition. So select number three and then install the Windows on drive C and then next. 
Now start installing the windows, uh, copying windows files and then getting ready for installation, 3%. And then you have to wait this one until it will finish, it will reach 200% and then uh, it will restart again. Okay. We are on 50% now installation. 87% now, 96%, 100% done installation. Now installing updates. Now it's required to restart the computer. You can remove now your uh, USB portable disk. Loading the windows. Getting devices ready. Restarting. Just a moment, please. So now we are on uh, region. Just select your current region and then yes. Keyboard layout, just a standard US, it's okay. Guys, on this portion, it's asking you to connect to a network. If you connect to your uh, internet or to your Wi-Fi, you have to prepare your email, of course, the Wi-Fi connection, everything, because it will ask you some information uh, regarding your uh, personal email. This is for advanced setup. Right now, I will show you only the basic one, so I don't want to connect it on the uh, internet. Okay, let's uh, continue with the setup. So, in this portion, you have to put the name of your PC. Yeah, let's see, Jason. You can also create your password but at the moment we'll try to disable yet the password so we can proceed to next activity history you can see yes no problem privacy settings for your device just uh, accept it's all it's all important so accept almost done now we're getting everything ready for you this might take several minutes but do not turn off your PC. Now, installation is done. We will enable the desktop icons here. So right click, personalize. Select the themes. And then this one, the desktop icon settings. Uh, put check for all this one, okay. And then apply, okay then now you have your uh, basic desktop icons we put two partition on this uh, laptop so we have to manage to format the second one at the moment we have only drive c so the drive d this drive d is our installer so we need to install the other one right click the piece uh, my computer and then manage and then click the disk management okay so we have the partition 4 here so we need to activate this one just right click and then format okay this is a standard ntfs and uh, the quick format no problem click ok now we have new volume uh, created healthy partition new volume of drive this is our uh, new drive now we create the new volume now this is the second partition okay this is the basic installation of Windows and after this you have to go to advance you have to check the drivers do control panel and check the drivers system and device manager see guys you have a lot here yellow mark this one so all of these devices you have to install the driver after okay so now we done already our uh, windows installation windows 10 professional but still i uh, recommended guys to use the original copy of microsoft windows so you can update anytime especially for uh, windows 11 now okay okay guys so na install na natin ng windows at uh, tapos na rin yung kanyang mga apps so check na lang natin kung uh, okay na lahat Check natin yung kanyang hard disk. So, ayan, nag-install naman lahat. 1TB. Ayan siya. 
to Shiba yung brand. So far lahat okay naman nung in-install ko kanina yung uh, Windows at yung kanyang mga apps. Okay naman lahat yung kanyang performance. So mabilis siya guys kasi bago siya. Ito kasi Core i3 lang siya pero 10th generation na siya. So okay na siya lahat. Makikita niyo siya Core i3 1.2 GHz 64-bit operating system na rin ang in-install natin. Okay. Na-share ko rin naman sa inyo yung paano nilodan ng Windows operating system ang laptop na to. And doon sa mga gustong mag-install ng Windows 10, panoorin nyo na lang yung video. Okay hey guys, so maraming salamat sa inyong panunood ulit. At huwag kalimutan na mag-like at subscribe kayo sa aking channel. Maraming salamat. Thank you very much for watching. And see you in my next video. Bye-bye.